in response to the unpleasant trend in the nation's traffic system, which resulted in the sudden rise of road accidents. The federal government in February 1988 established the Federal Road Safety Corps with statutory responsibility for road safety administration and management in Nigeria. While keeping a check on the functions of the agency, road users are praising the activities of the Federal Road Safety Corps of the uh, uh, this uh, institution of the federal government, uh, the work has been very fantastic, and they contributed hugely in terms of reducing accident along our ways nationwide. So the idea is a slight classical idea initiated by the former military president General Ibrahim Rabasima Wengida in the mid 80s. So it's a fantastic idea and they are helping the nation, and they are helping motorists. Uh, their performance has been amazing, uh, very, very amazing indeed, and uh, it's uh, commendable. Well, uh, I think they are doing good to the extent of uh, the facilities disposed, uh, at their disposal. You see, uh, if you look, road safety issue is supposed to be a 24-hour operation but what happens by six o'clock you don't see them on the road anymore and uh, you myself I ask this question most accidents happen in the night on the highways because of these trucks that are very reckless on the roads and in the cities late at night people coming from clubs or parties they drive recklessly and you see ghastly accidents happening but no road safety co operation at night. So this is a very big uh, drawback. I'm abiding by all their rules and regulations. You understand? So I believe they are doing their work. Although some of them are corrupt. But to the best of my knowledge, they are always on the way doing their best. At the same time, other commuters have different opinions. I don't think they are up to... They are up to um, what we needed in the road. Their population is not up to that what we needed. Either of them to be on the highway or doing their correction, that's the reason why they call the road safety. Either of them to be doing the road safety business, they will be doing collection of money. It's uh, a lot of complaint uh, about them, especially about, the, about corruption. And uh, uh, in most cases, they used to arrest people within metropolis instead of going to the you know, federal highways of which uh, the law guided them to do. However, there are lots of recommendations on how the government should strengthen the federal road safety cause with the mechanisms needed for the agency to carry out its mandate properly. They should avoid being indulging themselves into corrupt activities and uh, they should try to be up to the standard, especially compared to other emerging nations or other developed nations in terms of their performance. So they should redouble their effort so at least they can get more marks in the near future from Nigerians. In terms of even working tools, you see, ideally, for them to operate at night, I think, they need to be trained in armed handling. They need to be armed too. Because at night anything can happen. Armed robbers can decide to attack them. And they will be able to provide security at night as well. But the federal government needs to put more effort and fund for them. 